Is this a defensive move? Is this... I, I, is, is this about cost cutting or is this about innovation? I guess is my question. It's both. I hate to be devil's I hate to equivocate, but yes, it's both. Like on the one hand, if you make your own chips, it means you can make your software work more seamlessly, as you said, with said hardware, and so therefore you can perhaps improve battery life and in improve the latency, ensure it works more quickly. But crucially, what we're seeing with Apple at the moment is sales of hardware is flat are flattening, and therefore that means they've got to try to get even more profit out of the hardware they do sell. So therefore they're stretching back into the supply chain, integrating further backwards, and therefore trying to come up with their own innovations, which mean that they're not on the hook to Intel, for example, for their innovations yep. to drive the hardware and can therefore you know, deliver things to their own schedule. Where, so, so Intel suffers as a result of this. So I'm, there's a couple of questions on that. A, does, does anybody else do this and therefore hurt Intel even more? And B, is Intel just in the wrong business? Because it's easy to do this if you're Apple. It's relatively easy to do this if you're Apple. But there are more complicated bits of an iPhone that they're not in. So therefore, I wonder whether, whether the business model at Intel is, is now looking more flawed. So one of the problems that Intel has is it has very little exposure to the iPhone. Some might say that if you have exposure to the iPhone, that is also risk, of course, because yep. Apple can cut you out of that. But they have been trying to improve that by developing their own modems to, to enable connectivity in the iPhone. The, the thing that's interesting, if you compare, so Intel it is clearly a problem, but if you compare it to the, the peers that Apple has in the PC space, people like HP, <laughs> Lenovo, and so on, Asus, those guys they get their chips from Intel. So if Apple is there is able to develop chips which are better than Intel's and they get a they get a jump on the competition and are able theoretically to um, to deliver better hardware in the long term.